three, two, one, charge. All right. This is the final match before lunch break. And it's in autonomous right now as the bots are programmed to do what you see them doing right now, leaving the community, exiting the community. The bots are not supposed to go further than that center line in autonomous. If they do, they incur either a tech foul or a foul or a combination of tech fouls and fouls. It's 47 to 41 right now in favor of the Red Alliance coming out of autonomous as one bot goes over. All right, 9260. Dancing around the robot on its side, which is 6712. 4451. They've got that cute cone in their possession. They've got their arms swinging it up high, linking their nodes together. 10 point swing right there for the Red Alliance. 1746. Otto downfield with 9260 coming out of their substation. Colliding with 4451, knocking the cone out of their possession. They pick it back up. 4451 takes it, headed down as Otto and 9260. The Philip for Biv Robotics team scores high. Got a lot of action still taking place. Flags waving. All right. You can't carry more than one piece. You can't contact another robot while they're in their protected zone. A lot of things can happen. There's a lot of things that can go wrong out there on the field. The referees are keeping an eye on it, trying to make sure that no one alliance has an advantage over the other by making sure that the rules are followed. 24-15 briefly up on its side, writes itself back down as 17-46 launches their cube. It falls out. All right, now they've got it back inside, that painted line. Look at that. It switched from one side to the other. As long as the cubes or the cones are inside that painted line completely, they can be scored. If they're outside or touching the line, it won't count. As it's 103 to 96, it's tight right now with 25 seconds left to go. All it takes is one link to make a difference. All it takes is one bot more than the other up on the charging station. Like now, we see three red bots trying to dock and engage. The electrons are flowing on the Red Alliance side with three bots docked and engaged. That's 10 points apiece as we have two bots on the Red Alliance trying to do the same thing. They're rocking and rolling back and forth. Oh, my goodness. They had to be up there for three seconds. And it looks like it looks like one will be credited with a park and one will be credited with a dock right there. Wow, that'll be the referee's decision. That could be the difference in the match right there. Both alliances created or completed their sustainability ranking point assignment and get a ranking point for that as well. Match number 37. Once again, we will be breaking for lunch after the score. We will be returning for match number 38 at 1 o'clock. If you're in 38, you need to be ready to go on the field at 12.50. If you're in queuing at 38 and 39, you need to be there as well at 12.50. Match play will begin at 1 o'clock. We'll see you back then. Right now, we're waiting on that F1 to take off. They were held on pit road right now. They couldn't get out. They're waiting. They noticed something was a little askew on their car. They're working to correct it before they take off. They want everything to be right. Those cars are so low to the ground that their paint rubs off on the concrete. That's how we know who is victorious in that match. Hello?
All right, here we go with a score. In match number 37, the Red Alliance victorious with a score 149 to 119. 149 to 119.